It gets a Tesla-style North American charging system port, which means it has native compatibility at superchargers with plug-in charge, which means if you go to a Tesla supercharger, plug this in, it should work, no questions asked. Now, the good news is because that port is on the front right of the vehicle, that's the mirror image of the back left, which is where Teslas have it. So if you go nose into a supercharger stall, even if it's one of the older V3 stalls, you shouldn't have to double park at superchargers, which has been a big issue for people using adapters. You also get a J1772 slow charging port on the front left of the vehicle. That means if you already have a Nissan Aria or pretty much any other CCS equipped vehicle, you will have the same slow charging plug that is at your home or maybe at your office. The complicated part is that that is the only way to slow charge this vehicle. So that Tesla port on the front right of the vehicle, that's only for DC fast charging, only works at superchargers. So if you wanna use a Tesla style slow charger, then you need an adapter for that. And if you go to a CCS fast charging station, then you need a CCS to NAX adapter, which Nissan will include in some markets. Now, this has two ports, but even still, you're gonna end up carrying an adapter for the foreseeable future.